So the first way to do this is our first clip here has been colorized. If we click on the, the second clip, it doesn't have the color. So just the simplest way to do this is right click and do copy on this one and then go to the one that's not colorized and do right click and say paste attributes. Uh, make sure that Lumetri color is selected. If you have other things in here and you don't want to copy that over, some other things like um, zooms and everything else, uh, make sure they're deselected and select OK. And now as we go through, our color has been corrected on both clips. If you go up to the effects control panel and you're on this clip here to see it, you can see Lumetri color is here. And just by clicking this little FX, it shows you what it's like without the effect and with the effect. So you can see the difference. If you had multiple clips on here and you wanted to do this all together, again, you would just right click on the clip that you've um, colorized, select copy, and then just drag your cursor mouse over all the files. So they're all highlighted, right click, and say paste attributes the same way. Make sure Lumetri color is on, select OK, and then they also will be colorized. If by the way you want to remove the color, you do the opposite. You just say remove attributes, make sure Lumetri color is on, select OK, and now the, the other clips are back to normal. Another way to colorize all of the clips you have is you can come down here as long as you're in the editing panel come down to here and select adjustment layer just say okay and then drag this adjustment layer over the top here and you can see at the moment if i click on any part of this video or these video clips they're not colorized so do the same thing go to the piece you're colorizing select okay and copy and then you're going to paste this on the adjustment layer and say paste attributes, Lumetri color, OK. And now this guy is applying the color correction to your multiple clips. One word of warning here, though, is if you have, if this was all shot on the same color and you want the same type of color effect on all of your clips, then that's a good way to do it. But if you have multiple different clips from different sources, one color correction for everything won't do it. You'll have to make color corrections separately for different things here. Um, th if this was filmed on a different camera with different white balances and what have you. So like I said, if it just works well if you are uh, color correcting with the same color correcting to match a certain point of a video clip. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.